Welcome to the weekly and welcome to my pottery studio here in the heart of Marshfield Center on the South Shore of Boston, Massachusetts. Two things to update you on the weekly this week. First of all, I've been really promoting uh, my new charcuterie board collection. This is the long bowl. Let me give you a close-up shot of that. This is dipped in my alabaster white, and then right at the tip, I dip it in my sun yellow. And then it has, of course, my initial, uh, which all my work now has imprinted on it. Uh, the long board comes with just a little small dipping bowl. I like to place it right on the end of the bowl itself, uh, end of the board itself. Let me give you a close-up shot of that. Small dipping bowl, again, in the alabaster white and dipped in my sun yellow. This is a really handsome board. All of my boards are cut from a pattern, but they all have a unique look to them. They're all handmade and original, so no one board is ever going to be the same. So this board just had some really interesting effects that happened on the edges. Of course, when you dip it in the glaze, you never know exactly what it's going to look like when you pull it out of the kiln. So each board has a really interesting character to them. Now these are made to order pieces, so expect a three to four week uh, time frame before you receive the board itself. Then I have a smaller board, a little more manageable. I'll give you a close up shot of that. This is the round board. It almost looks like a pizza oven board. Again, this is triple dipped in my alabaster. So the, there's three different, I don't know if the camera's capturing that, but there's three different white areas on the board, which really adds interest to the charcuterie board itself. And then again, I, I dip it in my sun yellow right on the top. There's a little hole. You can hang it on the wall if you want to hang it and display it. Really two, two cool, interesting charcuterie boards. So again, a three to four week order time frame when you, when you buy these on my website. If you're local, these might be landing in a, there's two charcuterie shops here in Hingham and then in Co uh, Situate that I'm going to try to put these boards in. So if you're local, you might be able to purchase these fairly soon. The next collection item right here, I'm very excited about my gallery collection. This is a gallery collection number two. It hasn't even been fired yet, but it has such an interesting look to it. Number one is currently showing at the South Shore Art Center in their Blue Ribbon exhibit. If you're local, stop by uh, the South Shore Art Center in Cohasset and take a look at number one. It's a really interesting piece. It's made up of two vessels, uh, abstract in nature, on a, about a four foot wood pedestal. Uh, I found a really great piece of olive wood. Very interesting. I mean, the wood itself reads so much information. Thank you to Chris at Heirloom Tables. He let me use their studio in the back to uh, produce this board. The board is, it just lifts these pieces off the ground. So again, if you're local, please stop by the South Shore Art Center and take a look at this piece. If it doesn't sell in this current show, I'm hoping it lands in a gallery in Kingston, uh, New York. I'm still working on making that deal happen. If that piece doesn't land there, I'm hoping this piece lands there. This will be fired this week in the Bisque Fire. It will be glazed later in the week. So hopefully, maybe by the next weekly, this piece will be presentable. It'll be all glazed and I'll show you what it looks like. It's going to be in my alabaster white on the inside, a darker color on the outside, and in the middle, I'm going to do my cracked glass effect, which uh, people are really enjoying. So I keep doing those cracked glass effects glazes. Well, that's it for the weekly uh, for this Saturday. I will catch you next week with a couple further interesting updates. I am releasing my tile collection next week. So hopefully I'll be able to present all three colors for you. Uh, the charcuterie boards have been released. The tiles hopefully are released next week. And then 
I think, I think by September, I'm gonna have my pendants ready to go. Still working out the details on those. So until next week, as always, stay creative. <laughs>